Meals Plus has released a new series of enhancements and upgrades to our cafeteria software system, including a new serving screen option for your cashiers. The new serving screen is the product of feedback from Meals Plus users and is already receiving rave reviews. If you are currently a Meals Plus user, you are familiar with the original serving screen. It has a top to bottom flow of who are you serving, what items are they buying, and how are they paying. The lunch item grid can be color coded and the placement of each item is customizable for each cashier. On the right, you see the buttons to look up a student, your cashier's profile information, including the meal type and school you are serving, cashier name, date, and the button telling you you are online. Below that is the information for the student you are serving, including a photo, grade, teacher, serving site, and any special messages associated with that student. On the bottom, you see the buttons to view student meal history and review, clear, or avoid transactions. The new serving screen has all of the functionality of the original screen with a new navigation approach and even more useful features. It still has a top to bottom flow of who are you serving, what items are they buying, and how are they paying, but now your item grid can be grouped into categories. The system allows for four categories and is still color coded and cashiers can still move the items in the grid. In your toolbar, you will see the meal you are serving, the school site, the cashier's name, date, and if you are serving on or offline. If you use input devices to queue in student IDs, you now not only see the student you are serving, but the next four students you will serve. Students are added to the queue in the order they were inputted, and the student you are serving is at the top and highlighted blue. This image means that a student has been added to the queue. This image means that an invalid student was put into the queue. And this image means that there is a special message associated with that student. When you serve the student with a special message, you will see it under their name at the top middle of your screen. Included in each student's cell is their ID number, name, school site number, grade, and teacher's name. Below the student grid is a more detailed payment information grid. Not only do you see the total due, pending balance, amount paid, check number, and change due, but you also see the remaining number of reimbursable meals available to that student and the available balance on the account from the last transaction completed. The buttons to view the student's meal history and review all of your transactions have been moved here on the bottom left side of the screen. Another new feature is the meal count box. Here you see the number of reimbursable meals you have served that day. With the new serving screen option, cashiers can also change the font size of their meal items. Just click on the font size icon and the text in your item grid will change size. There are three font size options. The buttons to turn your receipt printer off or on or clear your transaction have moved to the bottom right. Remember that the new serving screen is optional and is easily managed in the Site Setup section in Meals Plus Point of Sale. If you are a Meals Plus user, contact our support staff today with any questions at 1-800-541-8999. If you would like to upgrade to the easy to use and easy to learn Meals Plus Point of Sale system, contact our sales team today at sales at mealsplus.com or call us at 1-800-541-8999. 541-8999. Meals Plus Point of Sale. We're keeping the lunch line moving.